Let's be honest, most foldable phones have been a massive disappointment. You're basically paying $2,000 to be a beta tester for a device that's too thick, has a distracting crease, and a battery that barely makes it to 4 p.m. Foldables promised us the future, but so far, they've only delivered compromise. But here is the shift that might change everything forever. Apple just signaled that the experiment is over. A new report confirms Apple is using a secret Samsung display tech to fix the single biggest problem with foldables, and it's coming to the iPhone Fold and the iPhone 18. This isn't just some minor spec bump. Apple is removing an entire physical layer from the screen, cutting power consumption by nearly 40%. And that changes the entire game. Here's the hidden villain no one talks about. Your phone's display is literally wasting power, by design. Every OLED screen you've ever used has a polarizer. It's a sheet of plastic that stops reflections so you can see your screen outside. It's useful, sure, but it blocks around half the light the screen produces. Imagine trying to light a room while holding a piece of cardboard in front of the bulb. Your phone has to burn extra energy just to stay readable. It's been silently killing our battery life for years. But Apple is finally done with it. They're switching to a tech called COE, Color Filter on Encapsulation. Instead of a thick plastic sheet, the color filter is applied directly onto the OLED pixels. The display becomes thinner, more efficient, and dramatically less power-hungry. No fighting physics. No wasted energy. Samsung actually invented this tech. They call it Eco 2 OLED, and it's the biggest reason their Fold series survives even on such small batteries. But Apple did what Apple always does. They waited. They let the tech mature. And now, Samsung Display says ditching the polarizer cuts power usage by a massive 37%. In this industry, a 5% gain is a win. 37% is a total reset of the hardware landscape. This is why the upcoming iPhone 18 and the rumored iPhone Air are expected to be shockingly thin. Apple isn't chasing bigger batteries anymore. They're making components so efficient that battery size almost stops being the limiter. Picture a foldable as thin as a Pro Max, but without the constant battery anxiety. It's the first time the hardware actually matches the hype. And Apple isn't stopping at the screen. They're pairing this display with a new metal can battery. Forget that soft foil wrapping you see in teardowns. This battery sits inside a rigid steel shell. That sounds small, but it allows Apple to push the battery directly against the frame with zero, quote, safety gap. Reports say the Fold's internals have been completely hollowed out, the logic board shifted to the side, and the entire center turned into a massive power vault. A screen that sips power combined with a battery that actually fills the phone. This is the moment foldables stop being a cool trick and start being a better version of the phone you already have. But don't think Samsung is just handing over the crown. The Galaxy S26 Ultra is rumored to adopt this same tech, setting up a massive 2026 showdown. iPhone 18 Pro versus the S26 Ultra, both racing for a true two-day battery life. For the first time in years, the bottleneck isn't the software, it's the physics of the display. The reality? Apple let everyone else fail first. They watched foldables struggle while they get perfect screen and the battery. The iPhone Fold isn't just another device, it's a reset of the entire smartphone industry. So be honest, if a foldable finally had real battery life and a slim design, would you switch? Or is the slab phone still undefeated? Drop your take below, I'm reading the comments. And if you want to see just how iPhone 18 Pro will go be a much bigger deal than you realize, tap the next video. With that being said, I will see you guys in the next video.